Hi! Do you like tempura as well? I do. But do you remember when you go to a Japanese restaurant, you order tempura and all you get is this? Now we are making our own tempura and this is where you could stuff your face with as much tempura as you want. So let's make tempura. So these are what we are using for our tempura. These are sweet potatoes, carrots, these are eggplants, zucchini or green squash that I have sliced, shrimp. I have about a dozen of them here peeled. I am using uh, a cup and a half of this tempura batter mix. I also have a tempura batter recipe in my uh, description. So if you don't have the tempura batter mix, you can make your own. And this is about a cup of water. I have a bowl of cube ice because you need to have your tempura batter really cold for you to be able to make crispy uh, tempura. So we are just gently mixing it. I'm adding another quarter cup because I find that the, the cup of water was a little bit thick. In a plastic bag, mix about a cup of uh, all-purpose flour. I'm adding salt and pepper to it. The flour mixture is going to make the tempura batter adhere better to it. I also have a large tray lined with paper towel where I'm going to put the already cooked tempura pieces. In the meantime, I have a pot of cooking oil and I have my handy dandy thermometer to make sure that the temperature is no less than 350 degrees. Next will be the zucchini or the green squash. These are the carrots and the zucchini. The carrots are nicely done and so are the zucchini. Eggplant. I'm skimming the extra batter that came out of the, the veggies. Now we're ready to do our shrimp. I'm holding it before I fully lowered it so it doesn't curl up immediately on me. Last one! This is what you call tempura heaven. I'm making the tempura sauce with mirin, soy sauce, a little bit of agave for added sweetness, and my latest favorite condiment. This is togarashi. I saw this from one of the cooking shows that featured Japanese uh, recipes. I really love it. But if you don't have it, it's fine. I mean, you know, just the combination of all of this uh, of all of these ingredients is really delicious. I'm adding about a cup of the mirin, a little bit of the soy sauce, I would say quarter of a cup.
I'm adding about half a teaspoon of the togarashi. I like saying that. Mix it. Oh yes. Mmm. So good. Thank you for watching. Maraming salamat po.